Valeria, you are curious, smart, patriotic, determined. You demand to be taken seriously, and you demand a lot of yourself, too. You're uninfected by cynicism. You don't start from the assumption that people are out to hold you back. In disappointment, you don't search for excuses or targets to blame. Your friendship is earnest and cooperative. You love and forgive selflessly. And you extend that same expectation to the people closest to you. Your openness is a vulnerability even knowing from experience that you can be crushed, you meet the world unguarded and, and how will it answer? I will take this cue <laughs> recklessly to claim a major part in your life and in your story and try to author with you chapters where bravery and integrity are recognized and cherished and demonstrate that that is the nature and moral character of the story we now share together. Wonderful. Oh, Valeria, you're next. <laughs> John, you are the most decent person, you're the most decent man I, I ever met. You are so, so bright and so so good and uh, I I remember like seeing pictures of you where you were taking small snakes uh, out of the leaves uh, below from below the leaves not to step on them and that kindness that kindness in the, of your heart is is your greatness and, and, and it's also your vulnerability so I I take you to to be my beloved husband and I promise to love you and to protect you and to support you in all your projects and I I always will be your safe place, your safe heaven and I will protect you from all turmoils I will I will take care of you and keep you safe and I I choose you to be my only one, my, my partner in life till it ends. And I promise you to be your closest friend and always act in your best interest. And I will do my best to, to be worth your love and to be worth your kindness. I want to inspire you. I want you to be proud of me. And I want to follow you and I want to share everything with you that I have. John, if you would repeat after me. I take thee, Valeria, to be my wife. I take thee, Valeria, to be my wife. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better and for worse. For better and for worse. For richer and for poorer. For richer and for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. Larry, if you'll repeat after me, I take thee, John, to be my husband. I take thee, John, to be my husband. To have and to hold. To have and to hold. From this day forward. From this day forward. For better and for worse. For better and for worse. For richer and for poorer. For richer and for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish. To love and to cherish. Till death do us part. Till death do us part. The rings you give and receive this day are the symbols of the endless love into which you enter as husband and wife. May the love between you, Valeria, and you, John, always be like these rings with no beginning and no end. John, take her ring first. And as you place this on her finger, please repeat after me. I give you this ring as a symbol of my eternal love. I give you this ring as a symbol of my eternal love. Wear it as a reminder of the vows we have made today. Wear it as a reminder of the vows we have made today. With this ring I thee wed. With this ring I thee wed. If you'll place this ring on his finger. 
Uh, and repeat after me, Valeria. I give you this ring as a symbol of my eternal love. I give you this ring as a symbol of my eternal love. Wear it as a reminder of the vows we have made today. Wear it as a reminder of the vows we made today. With this ring I thee wed. With this ring I thee wed. Valeria and John, from this moment forward you will never be alone. You will carry with you the love of another person, giving you a completeness and renewed lightness. May your life together be immersed in love and excitement. May you strive to enrich each other in every possible way. And may you work to bring the peace you find to this world of ours. I have two favorite parts. Here's the second favorite part. When I get to officiate for a couple this nice, I get to say, by the power vested in me by the state of Maryland, I can now pronounce you husband and wife. Now you know what my favorite part is. Seal your vows with a kiss. <laughs>